Hey everybody, Trisha from the Virtual Foundry here, ready to give you installment number two of what's on my fridge. Now this is the little fridge in my office. I like to have a collection of interesting prints on it. We're gonna walk through what's on my fridge today. Here we have a green copper calibration rings print that looks great. Printed on a regular standard FDM FFF 3D printer with filament, copper, metal 3d printing filaments now this is regular plastic it is a gavel because i like to lead a lot of meetings and always wished i had a gavel so somebody printed one of those for me this is 3d printed pyrex glass it's got that janky corner there because we like to mess with stuff and we messed with it after we centered it so that's what that looks like this is a musical instrument i am not going to try to play it for you but this is beautiful shined up copper um it's an ocarina i believe is the name of it coming over here we have um a nice screw and nut that was made by aron wayne um i will link put a link to his videos in the description here but as you can see it turns up and down very nicely that's a fun one and then we have some bronze centered chain mail. We like to make these because they really show the capabilities of 3D printing. This is a single print. Imagine trying to make this via uh, casting or machining or any other way. So those are really cool. Up here we have a big old chonker. This guy is heavy. So you can see how what a 3D print looks like after it's been machined. So that's been just cut clear on the top with a um, CNC machine. And this, what is this crazy conglomeration? This is pieces of filament put in a cup and run through the debind and center cycle and this is how they turned out. I think it's a pretty cool piece of art. Uh, this tube holds some lunar regolith um, that we got to, uh, I'm sorry, it's a simulant. It's a lunar regolith simul simulant that we got to turn into a 3D printing filament. That was very cool. And then the last piece is a centered copper coin that says thank you. No, no, thank you, filament, for giving us the ability to 3D print metal on our regular 3D printer. That concludes the fridge tour for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Reach out to me at info at thevirtualfoundry.com if you want to talk about how you can be innovative with your current 3D printer and make metal stuff yourself.